I try to get as much sleep as I can. Usually most of my roles um, are vocally demanding. So I am, on Mondays, it's very rare that I'm out like, you know, whooping it up. I'm pretty quiet at home. I actually see a larynthologist at least twice a year who goes in there and makes sure that the little cords are healthy and happy. Um, lots of steaming, lots of tea. I mean, it's the same old thing. And my sprays, which probably are placebos, but it's called Entertainment, Entertainer Secret and Singer's Saving Grace. One is like this, oh, sweet, delicious glycerin, and one tastes like fire and nothing you want to taste. But when you spray it, you feel like, oh, there's pain, it must be working. It's so crazy, so crazy, I won't do a show without it. <laughs> On a two show day, in the dressing room, I have this great chair. You go back like this and you go. If it's only 15 minutes, you don't need to sleep. You just go and your whole, all of this goes. It's great. I only plan like one extra thing a day. If it's a performance day, I can take one appointment a day. If I try to load up too much activity on a performance day, then I get too scattered and my energies get dispersed and I arrive at the theater you know, really distracted rather than ready to go. It's like you take care of yourself the best you can, but I'm exhausted all the time. And that is sort of the yin and yang to this amazing process. It demands a lot of me. It's, it's athletic. We really are athletes out there. And so you have to start treating your body that way. I eat different things. I try to eat healthily. For me, the most, the secret weapon is that I nap between shows. And for me, you know, I, 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 I tend to to pray, you know, I have a little prayer before every show um, just to say to myself and just to ask for the strength and the power and the foresight to make it through and to be in the moment and to not like, you know, it's not just a, another performance. It's a new audience, never seen the play. You know, Lord, can you allow me to experience this play for the first time? again. And then the other thing is 12 long and deep breaths before I go on stage. It'll just make you present right. is what it does. Yeah. It's a ritual. It makes you present. It makes you right in that moment and you're breathing. Not that you're coming on stage, but your breath is activated and you're, you can't help but be in the moment. Sleep, exercise, coffee. So much humidifying that everywhere I go should be like a rainforest. I get super dry really easily. <laughs> Lots and Ricola, for whatever reason, sugar-free Ricolas are like crack cocaine to me during a show. I mean, I'll go through like five or six in the course of one show, which is super unhealthy probably. Yeah, probably. But my voice sounds great. <laughs>